okay, so this is my third time recording this session. This is Final Fight on the Super Nintendo. And once, the first time I recorded it, I got all the footage, but it didn't come out very good because my commentary was kind of bullshit and a lot of stuttering. The second time I did it, I accomplished something that I never accomplished when playing this game. But the footage did not capture and it only saved eight and a half minutes of my 30 minute commentary. So, we're gonna do this a third time. And hopefully, we this video will work out for the best. But yes, this is Final Fight for the Super Nintendo. Oh my god, that guy's freaky looking. Yes, from Capcom, the same guys did Street Fighter, Mega Man, Dead Rising, etc. Fight. Final. Yep, final fight. This is a very nostalgic game for me. Uh, we're gonna actually start with Cody. Uh, okay, basically as you saw in that intro, as I was talking over, um, Mike Hagar is the mayor of... Um, Metro City, and his daughter has been kidnapped by some gangs. And when your mayor is Mike Hagar, I think the last thing you want to do is kidnap his daughter. So basically, he and her boyfriend Cody are off to um, save her from the gang. Um, this was originally an arcade game with two players, but for some reason on the Super Nintendo, it's just two, it's just one player. But this was a game that I played a lot back in the day on an actual Super Nintendo. What happened was I, um, my grandparents had a Super Nintendo. Um, I think like f whenever they had their grandkids over and me and my cousins would play it a lot. We had uh, Final Fight, we had Turtles in Time, Super Star Wars, Super Mario World. Um, Home Alone, the video game, and, uh, some game, some flight game that was like, um, Life Force. I, I don't remember the exact name of it, but, um, it reminded me very much of Life Force. It might very well be Life Force. Oh, But, um, yeah, the Final Fight and Turtles in Time were the ones that we played the most. And with good reason, because Super Nintendo beat 'em up games on the Super Nintendo are just a lot of fun to play as. Because the sound effects are just so awesome. I'm gonna beat the shit out of you, Axel. And Jay. Cody kind of looks like Captain America. I mean, he's got the huge muscles, like in the com in some of the comics. Uh, his hair's blonde. Except the raid I'm playing, if this guy were actually Captain America, I would not be able to do Captain America justice huh? because kind of getting my ass kicked. There goes Wan Hu. Take that, Hollywood. And that. And there's just some guys chilling here, and I'm gonna... They killed me. I intended to throw Jay, but he just killed me in one punch. And I probably should have gotten that before I died. The sound effects are so awesome. All right, good. An extra life. There we go. Oh, there's Thrasher, the first boss. 
doing jumps that I don't think are physically possible for anyone to do. Especially since Final Fight really... It's by Capcom, but it's not as exaggerated as Street Fighter is. I like how casual Simmons walks out of the door and then he just gets the shit beaten out of him. By some guy who looks like Captain America. What's with Jay, yeah? Like, he's just like a super villain, or. Yeah, I guess, I guess super villain. Take that, Thrasher. There we go. I thought only Hag I thought those were only available once Hagar comes out. Oh. Yeah, I hear you, ghost symbol. I'm, tr I'm trying to beat the shit out of some assholes. With a knife now. Damn it. I know I'm not making it to the final boss. Just stabbing everyone with a knife. Or it was. Take that, Andore. And some guy apparently hit. Screw you, Doug and Bread and Bread's clone. So why is J and Two P? Why are they dressed like super villains? Aww. All right, well, Cody's out. Try, let's give Hagar a shot, huh? When you can't depend on your daughter's boyfriend to get shit done, you just gotta do it yourself. Huh? Especially since you're the mayor of this city. Girl. Ooh, a katana blade. Girl. And there goes the katana blade. I didn't even use it once. Yeah, I hear you. I'm beating the shit out of guys. I know I've said that already, but... It's just so frustrating when, like, the game tells you to move on when you're in the middle of stuff. Take out Doug again. I'm gonna take out Brent again and Brent's clone. Moving on. Fuck you, Slash. Fuck you, 2P. Fuck you, Jay. I don't know why you and 2P dress like supervillains. I'm gonna throw you. I'm gonna pile drive you to the ground. Yeah. 
headbutt your crotch. Boom. This is the kind of stuff that happens when you're... There are two... Th oh, God. Damn it. All right, there's a... Uh... God damn it. Get over here, you... You pussy. Just quit hiding behind the screen. Quit hiding out of the screen. You know, I gotta say, for the amount of time... Uh, Hagar goes out and beats the shit out of some civilian thugs. He doesn't, he doesn't seem to really care that all the subway um, windows are pretty much smashed in. Even the one that's driving by us is like pretty much smashed in. Okay, give me some food. I don't know if that was food, but it didn't look like it did anything for my health. Ow, damn it. Stop by a knife. Huh? I guess, like, the last playthrough I was actually doing really well, but I'm just, like, right now I'm just so frustrated that this is the third time I've had to record it, uh, and that's why it seems like I'm doing a little poorly. I threw the knife at him and that didn't do shit. Fuck you, Elgato. Alright, give me some food, huh? We're nearing the boss in this level. Okay, so the thing that I did that I've never done in the game before, in the previous recording that's now lost forever, is uh, I defeated the second boss of this level, El uh, Katana. Or, yeah. Because he was someone- SHUT UP! Message. He was someone that I could never beat, uh, the previous times I've ever played there. Look at that frame rate, huh? And I was, like, so thrilled that I finally beat him. And right now, I don't think it's happening. I don't think I'm gonna beat him. Yep, I barely have any health. See? Are you kicking my ass? Come on. Come on, Mike. God damn it. Ooh, ooh. Come on! Oh. Yes! Fuck you, Katana! There. Awesome. Meanwhile, there's one security guard um, watching the show. Just saw Mike Hagar slice Katana with a katana. And he's like... And he goes to the other guard and says, Uh, is that legal what he just did? And the, and the conversation just goes like, No. What, are you gonna stop him? 
it, for some reason, it doesn't feel as good trying to repeat the same jokes you made in the failed recording. But, you know, beating up a car. There we go. Please give me another life. No life. Damn it. Oh, my car. Oh, no, my car. The voice acting back then is just so cheesy, I gotta say. But here we go. Finally got past Katana. Let's beat the shit out of these guys. Oh no, there's Andore. Damn it. Oh shit, there's Andori J or that's Andori Jr. The other one's Andore. Okay, other life. Good, because I just lost that extra life. I love this way how Mike enters a club. Just punch the door open. Oh yeah, the pipe's still in there. Here, you get a pipe. Here, a pipe for you, pipe for you. who looks like um, Stromboli from Pinocchio. Oh, you want some? Oh, crap, and Dore Jr.'s back. Damn it! That's not what I wanted to do. I'm just gonna keep punching. I oh, took out Andori Jr. at least. Alright. Let's give Cody another shot. Not a good start for Cody. Yeah. All right, time to take out father and son. Damn it, you fucking bastard. Come on. There we go. I'm just gonna keep punching you until you try to run into me as I'm punching constantly. There you go. Still not dead. There you go. Sorry, Cody. We can't let you into the club. But fuck you! I'm going in. Yeah. 
I wonder how security has not bothered to um, escort Cody out because he just starts a fight. He just goes into bar the club to start a fight with people. Come on. Get the shit out of all of you. Picked up some. Was those grapes? I thought those were jewel. I thought that was some jewelry. It definitely looked shiny. Oh god. Just murdering everyone with a knife, huh? I thought I killed you, Andori Jr. Oh. Come on. Oh my god, how many guys are here? Oh, okay, there we go. Moving on. Oh, this part. I think I need to be more... I think uh, Cody and Mike Hagar need to be more afraid of the Andore family. Yeah. Alright, there's a crowbar. Yeah. Get the shit out of you guys. Oh, damn it. Damn it. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, we'll keep going a little more. Everyone gets two turns. Cody got two turns. Time for Mike Hagar to get two turns. And then we'll call the day after. I lose, because I definitely know I'm not going to make it very far after this. Come on. Here. There goes Andore Jr. Now I just gotta take out Andore, who... His sprite up there pretty much looks like, um... Mike Hagar if he had a mullet. Or... Just longer hair. He got the same... He looks like he has the same mustache as... Mike Hagar, even though... I'm punching him and he has no mustache at all. You can't beat the Mike Hagar mustache. Boom! Come on. Come on, Hollywood. Ooh, extra life. Good. Give me the apple. That barely gave me any health. Kill everyone in this club with a katana blade. And there goes the katana blade. Oh, I'm just throwing knives at everyone now. Oh, damn it. You must die. Yeah. I probably feel like I should be talking more to make the this let's play a little more interesting, but like I'm I'm really into the game right now, and I already lost the katana play. That's that's that sucks.
Oh, damn it. Oh, that's not fair. Andori relatives need to die, huh? God damn it. G Andori and you Andori have to die. Oh, god damn it. That is not fair. Alright, G Andori is dead. I just gotta take care of you, Andori. Oh, damn it. There we go. Yep, that's not happening. Point of Hagar. Oh, I beat my score from the past game. Okay. Same initials again. Yeah. Alright, so I guess that's final fight. Hopefully this footage gets captured, uh, but if it does get captured, that means you're already watching it. So, um... Yep, there's my initial up there. So, leave a comment, tell me what you thought of this playthrough. Uh, tell me what you think of the game if you played it. Like, subscribe, go check out my video blog channel. You can follow me on Twitter, Instagram, go like me on Facebook. Yeah. This is the real Mr. Robinson telling you there's only one. Come back next Tuesday as we get the return of John Marsden. See you guys later.